Right, take a look at this surveillance video shows how a fire truck rushing to a fire today in Oakland slammed into a building and now a search is on for another driver suspected of being involved in this incident and three Oakland firefighters were hospitalized because of this crash. It happened at the intersection of Grand Avenue and Perkins Street around 1245 this afternoon. KTV's Alyssa Harrington is live in Oakland and Alyssa any update on the conditions of these firefighters at this point. Well, the firefighters were all released from the hospital at around 8 o'clock tonight, and luckily the area of the building that was hit was vacant at the time. The battalion chief told me, though, this incident is very concerning, and the fire department is working with the police department to try to figure out exactly what happened. A mangled fire truck is pulled from a building at the intersection of Grand Avenue and Perkins Street in Oakland. The OFD ladder truck carrying five Oakland firefighters crashed Saturday, injuring three of them. They were responding code three with lights and sirens to a reported structure fire when the accident occurred. Surveillance video from a nearby business shows the truck swerved to avoid another car. Let's watch that again. Two fire trucks are seen traveling down Grand Avenue. A car at the light on Perkins pulls in front of the second truck. That ladder truck then slams into the building. David Diller was walking dogs nearby and saw the aftermath. There were uh, several firefighters around helping to extricate one of the crew members that was still left in the front of the cab. They definitely looked dazed and a little bit banged up, but beyond that, they seemed like they came through it okay. The firefighter suffered moderate injuries, including some broken bones. They were treated at Highland Hospital. This building includes 21 apartment units. I thought it was an earthquake was my first thought. Creepy Kambayan lives here. She was inside her second story apartment and felt the whole building shake. She packed her suitcase, unsure when she can return. They said they were turning off the water. Um, I left for a little bit and then came back and they said, you know, it's not safe to go back in the building. We've turned off the water, we've turned off the gas. A water pipe was hit, which flooded the lower level of the building, where a new bookstore was supposed to open this summer. Engineers and building inspectors were at the scene, checking the building for structural integrity. Nobody else was hurt. We're going to look into everything that occurred in this and ensure that it never happens again. And we want to make sure that we keep our citizens safe as well as our firefighters. Now, of course, you are supposed to yield to an emergency vehicle, and firefighters tell me that that vehicle seen in the surveillance footage has not yet been located and that the driver never stopped. Anyone with additional information or who might have other video is asked to contact police. Reporting live in Oakland, I'm Alyssa Harrington, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Yeah, firefighters rushing to help ending up needing help themselves. Alyssa, thank you.